when hearing about the Trump administration's plans uh, for border security, the emphasis really is on this mass deportation. Uh, what we saw here today is the actual work happening at our ports of entry that are inter interdicting drugs, keeping those drugs off our streets. Uh, and, and we need more of that to, uh, to secure the border here. As you know, Trump has promised that he would carry out mass deportations on day one of his presidency. Your state is estimated to have a quarter of a million undocumented immigrants. Some Democrats in your state, like Phoenix Mayor uh, Kate Gallego, say that she wouldn't allow police to be used to carry out this plan. Would you as governor allow state police and National Guard to carry out mass deportations? Uh we will not be participating in misguided efforts that harm our communities. And I've been incredibly clear about that. So you disagree with mass deportations and the fact that the president elect says that's what he's going to be working on day one. Well, I think that those efforts are going to uh, divert needed resources that we need here uh, on these drug interdiction and smuggling and trafficking efforts uh, to keep harm out of our communities. Uh, we need those resources here. Uh, and the, the um, coming here today and seeing this operation firsthand just underscores that, that, that working in partnership here is how we can best secure the border. What would worry you the most, Governor, about mass deportations? Well, I think the diversion of law enforcement from um, their, their, the, the work that they do every day to keep our communities safe, uh, people hiding in fear. Uh, we saw that uh, under previous state policies here, uh, and uh, it, it harms communities. Uh, it tears families apart, and uh, we're not going to, that's not going to happen on my watch.